The following video showcases the views and opinions of young adults from the age group of 9 to 18 years. This is an attempt to get students to speak about issues that are close to their heart. Watch and get a glimpse of what the future of India is thinking and where is India's youth headed. Viewers are requested to consider the student's age before judging and voting. Yesterday, I asked Alexa, what is 300 into 5 plus 14? And she replied, today's day is Friday, date is 22nd February 2019. For a second, I was just, what? And what, did I go wrong with something? What just happened here? So hey friend, this is Dig Vijay Dado with the topic Artificial Intelligence. Does AI mesmerize you, make you curious, or make you question usual or unusual? After hearing Alexa's answer, I was just shocked. And at the next moment, I remembered that today's artificial intelligence is not yet developed. Therefore, it can go wrong sometimes. But the day is not far when every next person to us will be a humanoid robot. And this will be possible only due to artificial intelligence. For some people, the question is, what is artificial intelligence? Artificial intelligence is a term which was first coined by John McCarthy. He, he was a computer scientist in 1955. He took his first computer artificial intelligence conference in 1956. He is also known as the father of artificial intelligence. He defines it as science and engineering of developing intelligent machines. We can also define artificial intelligence as it is a full development in computer systems which allows the uh, machines to work similar to humans such as speech recognition, decision taking, thinking, etc. On 27 December 2017, a student from IIT Bombay privileged to host a sari clad AI infused Sophia. Saudi Arabia's first robot citizen at the tech fest. In her interview, she says that she wants to make difference in the future. When she is asked that, how do you learn things? She takes a flip and then answers, what are your opinions on Bitcoin bubble? Which emits a laugh from the interviewer. She does get full marks on answering that she is a robot and technically she has no gender. But she loves the fact and perceives herself as a woman. Now, we all know that everything in this world has a main purpose. Therefore, the main purpose of artificial intelligence is to develop such machines which can work better than humans. Well, you all heard the phrase, every coin has two sides. Similarly, artificial intelligence also have its own advantages and disadvantages. If we talk about the advantages, they are little helpful as it can, we can operate it anytime without any risk and if we use it properly, it can lead us to a better future. Now let's turn to the disadvantages. The disadvantages are that it affects our physical health badly as humans can become overly dependent on machines. They can eventually kill us or rule on us. So at last I would like to conclude that we should develop artificial intelligence at a certain extent. As Stephen Hawking once said, full development of artificial intelligence can lead to end of human race. So we hope that the AI infused robots be like friends to us and not make us think the impending danger. Thank you. Don't forget to like and subscribe.